All right, it's looking good, actually. I'm slightly happy with this. It's looking all right, looking pretty good. The body, I am actually making steps. I'm making baby steps. And those little baby steps count towards something. I'd say that's one notable thing that helps with motivation is that when you're when you're when you see the blank piece of paper it can be difficult to start it'll be easy to get yourself into this tangle of brain mess and one nice way to get yourself rolling is to just start a lot of people say okay just start but it kind of it kind of works like do something where you add a line or add a shape because you can edit that line that's one big thing that you gotta get yourself into is try to get yourself in that editing phase ASAP if you can get to the editing phase you'll be able to actually start doing the thinking and I mean the right thinking the actual okay what am I actually doing and what I'm expecting of myself and when you actually have a thing that's there you know okay what's wrong with this thing and then you can actually make real steps to improve it and change it and make it you know more towards what you want like uh, a, 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 a notable pro tip when it comes to writing a story is to write the wrong progression like try to purposely write where you don't want the characters to go and in a way it'll reveal where you actually do want to have your characters going so say you have a character being like okay I want to go to the store and get some milk or you have a John Doe and he needs to go get milk from the store so if you end up like getting stuck and kind of figuring out okay why does he go to the store what happens at the store or what's stopping him from going to the store you could do something where you know you could just write down the wrong things that you don't want like say there's orange juice at the store or there's a hole in the ground or there's a meteor that just falls out of the ground and hits him you know those are incorrect for your story and you can just quickly strike them out you're going through your bad ideas in order to figure out the good ideas that actually work for you so when you do that that goes same for drawing that's go same for music it's editing where you're getting yourself to ponder what you're what you really really want and just having anything down will help you because it's easier to edit than to write something whole new so sometimes when i'm writing and i get stuck i'll tend to write something more you know tell but don't show Whereas like, okay, Cole needs to, Cole's in a, in the middle of a, Cole's in the middle of fighting Nad. They're having a dialogue exchange. And I, I literally write that. I literally write, they're having dialogue exchange about, uh, Nad is really good with arrows. How do you get good with arrows? And I literally write that so I can just have that as a placeholder, say, fill that out later. So I can like, you know, write something clever or do something else or may you just need a picture, you know, really need dialogue for that. You know, you can just re-edit as you see fit. And having those little bits that can help you get yourself into just working at getting a basic thing done, anything done. And that can help immeasurably.